Que la mipo. Yeah. Ya. No. Oh. Hello my Luminites, it is Ivy and welcome back to my channel or if you are new here, hello, my name is Ivy, also known as Intuitive Ivy M here on this channel and welcome to my channel. So this channel is all about the magical, the mystical, and the supernatural um, and yeah, so welcome to my channel. So today I have something different. I took a 23andMe DNA test. And I finally, after so long, I finally got the results of my DNA just because this is something that I've been wanting to do for such a long time. And now going into spirituality, like I really want to dive deep into my heritage and like what was studied on the spiritual aspect you know, according to like my heritage and my ancestors and all that. And so this is honestly something that's very meaningful to me. This is something that I really want to like connect with and get like really in tune with. So I'm so excited to be showing you guys my results. Um, I'm also going to try posting a few videos of like responses from like my parents. Um, once I tell them because they have no idea what they are they're like oh yeah I think I'm a little bit of this but I'm not so sure and I'm I think I'm a little bit of this so according to my mom we're Spanish um, like from Spain and uh, according to my dad I'm obviously and then most of me is like Mexican um, but from like the Spanish side from like Spain um, and then according to my dad um, his side of the family is like uh, Mayan or Aztec one of those tribes and German and Chinese but he's not a hundred percent sure because he doesn't know like he doesn't he didn't really know like my like actual like grandfather too well so very interesting very interesting combination I want to be in tune with my heritage like I really want to know where I come from because I want to dive deep into my ancestors and our teachings and all of that you know get to the root core let's let's, let's just get to the root of this um so yeah so I have footage of when I first got my kit however I'm not sure if I still have it because as you can probably see here my phone is like back to its original wallpaper um, because it wiped out we went to we took a trip like a family trip and my phone just wiped out like it just stopped working on me mercury retrograde <laughs> is like it really messed with my phone okay so let's take a look at my ancestry report <gasps> okay so I pulled it up <laughs> okay so I am 49% European. I am 48% Southern European, 47% Spanish and Portuguese, 0.9% uh, Southern European, 0.5% Finnish, very interesting, 0.5% Jewish oh my god okay 0.5% Jewish 0.2% uh, Eastern European and 0.2% oh I am Asian okay and indigenous American very interesting. So I am 41%, I'm 49% European and I'm 41% Indigenous, okay, East Asian and Indigenous American. I am 40.8% Indigenous American. That makes me so happy. Like, I wish I could get like in deeper like what indigenous <sighs> I am 0.2% Asian so I'm only 0.2% Asian Mongolian 0.2% Mongolian and 0.5% East Asian and indigenous American I am 
0.4% Sub-Saharan African. That's so interesting. Okay, so I'm 3.9% West African. I am 3.5% Senegambian and Genuian. I am 0.2% Nigerian and I'm 0.2% West African and 0.9% East African. 0.4% Southern African and 2.6% unassigned Mexico and Central American. Very, very interesting. Native American. So I'm 40%, 47% Native American. That's so cool. That is so cool. I think, oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna have to find out more exactly what that entails and like what type, like, cause I wanna know, you know, like I wanna get more into the root of that. Like, cause like indigenous American can mean, I wonder what tribes that exactly, that can all be. Cause of course there's many, you know? Another cool thing that this has, it's like, it gives you reports based off of your health. Um, and just like, like factors based off of like different things based off of, you know, your likelihood of you getting it based off of your DNA. So for example, like gout, I have like a big likely increased likelihood of getting gout, non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, sleep apnea is an increased likelihood for me, which is very, very interesting. Um, atrial fibrillation, kidney disease. This is so cool. Like, I like how it tells you what you are more prone to getting based off of your DNA. And then, of course, like putting in your like family's history and all that. I think this is really cool. I really like this a lot. Um, so, I had so much fun doing this. Okay, so I found out my DNA. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah? I'm 48% mm -hmm. European. Oh, really? Portuguese. Portuguese. And Spanish. Ah. Um, also, I'm 0.5% Jewish. Really? Yeah. 0 0.5, okay. Uh-huh. I'm 0.5% Mongolian, Asian. Mongolian. Asian. Mongolia. What about Chinese? Zero percent. Can I be positive? Yeah, no. zero percent. No. <laughs> yeah! Okay, Forty percent uh, indigenous American. Native American. Forty percent? Hmm. Mm -hmm. For which side? Probably yours. <laughs> so, oh, my dad, maybe? Yeah, 40 percent. Native American. On my side? Mm -hmm. Nothing I know, I'm not even new Native American. And I'm, guess what? What? 5.6% African. <laughs> yeah. I don't know where that comes from. That too? Yeah. 3.5% from Guinea? Guinea, Guinea Africa? Africa. Yeah. yeah. Yeah? Well, um... What is it? <laughs> That's all. Okay. 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 Yeah. okay. I'm forty-eight percent European. European? Yeah, Portuguese and uh, Spanish. Oh, really? Uh huh. Wow. I'm zero point five percent Jewish. Uh, zero point five percent Mongolian. Mongolian. Five point six percent African. From Guinea. Oh my god. And 40% indigenous American, Native American. Oh. 4%? 40. 40%. 40%, 40, 40 Native American. 40 and 40, you're 40 Indi 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 Indi
Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.